This video tutorial will demonstrate how to set employee data entry requirements in Empire Suite. First, log into your account. Go to the Administration main menu. On the left-hand side menu, select Data Entry Requirements for Employees submenu under the Employee main menu. A Data Entry Requirements for Employees dialog box will appear. Data Entry Requirements for an employee are typically set up just once, but firm administrators can edit these specifications anytime. Select the time units that employees can report their time using the drop-down menu. Temporal increments are based on the hour. This time will show up in the employee's timesheet. Select whether or not employees must submit approved time in order using the drop-down menu. If no is selected, then the employee can submit and approve their time periods whenever they wish. If yes is selected, then employees must submit and approve their time periods in sequential order of date completed. Set minimum hours required for employee self-reporting using the drop-down menu. Users can select from daily, none, and approval period options. Users can select from daily, none, and approval period options. Having none minimum hours requirement means that employees can enter in any hours worked. Having daily minimum hours period means that employees must enter a minimum number of hours worked every day. Having approval period minimum hours period means that employees must enter hours worked based on previous approval period settings. Select warning options to alert employees if they have not reported their minimum requirement using the drop down menu. Employees have the option of receiving an error message or warning message if they have not reported their minimum requirement. Employees also have the option of not setting up any notification for missing minimum hours. Within the boundaries category, enable and specify exact number of roll forward or fallback days to define number of approval periods. There are three categories, fees and expenses approval period, daily expenses, and expense warning. Users are restricted to setting dates for approving fees and expenses incurred for a specific project, specific expenses incurred on specific days, and warnings for expense parameters. Enable these options by clicking the checkbox. Enter the desired number of days in the back forward number boxes. Click save to save your changes or click close to exit out of the data entry requirements for employees. This concludes the tutorial on how to set employee data entry requirements in Empire Suite.